I see. Ready to go? A routine job, right? No sweat. I wonder. Originally, Sephiroth was assigned to this mission. That means it's a top priority matter. Be alert or you'll fail. And Sephiroth? Refusing to go, apparently. Oh, what is that? They spoil him too much. <laughs> Why don't you say that to his face? Uh, no thanks. Weird trees. Benora white trees. Or dumb apples. That means this is Benora Village? And Geo's hometown? Correct. Genesis and Angeal have known each other a long time. I saw them in Wu Tai. So they are here. We've seen no townspeople yet. They may have taken control of the whole town. When Genesis left, he took an arsenal along with him. Retriever destroy. Those are the president's strict orders. Okay, no sweat. Orders will be met. Activating A Genesis copy. Where did you hear that? Sephiroth said it. The technology was stolen from our scientists. Huh? It apparently allows Genesis's abilities and traits to be transplanted to soldier members and monsters. Soldier and monsters? We're the same?
refreshing taste that goes down smooth. Benora white juice, 120 gill each. Sounds tasty. <laughs> Apple factory is up ahead, past the housing community, huh? Internal issues have to be dealt with before they leak. No sign of the townspeople. Check the houses. This is Genesis's home. His parents are wealthy landowners. But I never stole from that tree because the wealthy man's son was my friend. They weren't mere acquaintances. They grew up together and were best friends. So Genesis deserts and gets his best friend Angeal to join him. Is that it? Sephiroth believes that's the case. There. A gravestone, still very new. Zack, go find Angeal's house. I'll check the grave. Ugh, so Turks always do this stuff? Someone has to do it. it must be rough. Don't worry, we're paid much better than you are. No way! Zack, go find Angeal's house. It should be over there. It's likely already in enemy hands. Be careful. Activating combat out of the way. <laughs> Let's see, Angeal's house is... Somewhere! All right, I'll just have to check each one. Anybody home? Can't hear anything, and the door's locked. Anybody home? Can't hear anything, and the door's locked. Anybody home? Activating combat mode. Conflict resolved. Oh yeah! Anybody home? Can't hear anything, and the door's locked. Greetings, ma'am. Are you Angeal's mother? Um, my name is Zack. Are you Zack? 
the puppy? Excuse me? <laughs> My son wrote to me once about you. Zero attention span. Restless as a little puppy. <laughs> oh, thanks, Angeal. You're not here together with Genesis, are you? No, I'm not. Don't worry. What is happening with my son? I'm not really sure. Genesis came back here a month ago with an army of cohorts. And they proceeded to take the lives of many townspeople. Genesis... He used to be such a good boy. Is Angeal... He came here. But he left his sword and went off somewhere. That sword represents our family's honor. I see. No wonder. He never uses this sword, really, ever. I'll take care of Angeal. You should go and hide somewhere. Don't be concerned. Genesis cannot harm me. Hmm. Jill decided to join Shinra. My husband had that sword made for him and told him to fight with honor. He borrowed a lot of money. And then, he worked so hard to return the debt, he eventually died of fatigue. So young. Must be when he first joined Soldier. And there it is. That Buster Sword. This one's a family picture. <laughs> Look at Angeal. Showing off that Buster Sword again. This must be Angeal's father. Looks like a serious guy. A baby picture. This is Angeal? So cute. Now these two rascals must be Angeal and... Genesis. Please be a good friend to my son. Angeal, where did you go? <laughs> what? Genesis copies. Activating combat mode. Take that, huh? <laughs> There's a factory on the outskirts. I saw a Genesis copy go in. You think it might be their HQ? I do. I'm on a cliff overlooking the factory. The best way in is from above. Come to the clifftop now. Activating combat mode. Activate 
Activating combat mode. Genesis's parents were in that grave. Wait, he... his own family? We can't expect reason from him. What about Angeal? He wasn't at the house. But please, give me time. If I find Angeal, I can talk to him. If I can convince Angeal, maybe Genesis will come back too. I understand now why Sephiroth chose you. Huh? Genesis and Angeal. Those two were Sephiroth's only friends. He didn't want to fight them. That's why he refused the mission. Well, Angeal is my friend too. He's counting on you to bring them both back. <sighs> Time is short. Let's go. Made it in, no problem. Go on ahead, I've got your back. Activating combat mode. <laughs> Conflict resolved. Zack, this way. Keep sharp. This is where the copies are made. Go upstairs. Genesis may be there. Mystery is the gift of the goddess. We seek it thus and take to the sky. Ripples form on the water's surface. The wandering soul knows no rest. <laughs> Settle down, Zack the puppy. <laughs> The grave at the house. We found the remains of our people there as well. It didn't take much to have them send false reports. Just some mild threats. 
They would have done that anyway. At least your parents would have. My parents betrayed me. They had always betrayed me from the very beginning. What do you know? Shit, relax, dogs! <laughs> Welcome, partner. I see. You finally made your decision. I'll respect your wishes, old friend. However... Can you really live on that side? Angeal! Did he leave the factory? There's no time. We have to leave now. Wait! We're gonna give up the search? We can't leave any evidence. An airstrike has been called. Are you sure nobody is at Angeal's house? Huh. Angeal's house! Hurry! Sound and color, huh? I have to get to Angel's mom quickly.
I hope she's all right. Gotta find her. Now. After some deliberation, I've managed to buy a little more time. Go do whatever needs to be done. Thank you, Tsung. Those shells are Shinra products, too. So you'll be rewarded for destroying evidence of the company's involvement. mother could not continue to live and neither can her son what are you talking about what's going on here i told you <gasps> you can't live on that side anymore <sighs> Do you fly away now? To a world that abhors you and I? Shut up! All that awaits Shut you up! I'm is a somber you. morrow. No matter where the winds may blow. I don't see Sephiroth today, but are you gay? Summons aren't meant to be used like this. What happened to dreams and honor? We are... monsters. <gasps> we have neither dreams nor honor.
soldier. Doesn't mean monster. Jill. And Jill. The war is over. Everyone's real happy. As for me... That sword represents our family's honor. You're a little more important than my sword. But just a little. <laughs> Where did you go? Zack here. It's been a while, Zack. Sephiroth. Come to Lazard's room. Uh, all right. Activating combat mode. Thank <laughs> you. 
Activating combat mode. Oh, so we still got time left. All right, all right. I wonder what it's gonna be. Hey, I was a little bit disappointed. Not really, because I mean, I guess I didn't really have any expectations. But I was kind of hoping for the. Is it? Is it the director's cut of Death Stranding? Because I don't think it is. Yeah, that's it. This. Do you like to eat first? 
You've heard it's some FPS? Man, that sucks. <laughs> I was hoping for the Final Fantasy VII remake. <laughs> Directors was accidentally given for the first two? Fuck! Dude, that's why I couldn't download it for like four hours. Dude, I'm not sure if you had the same issue as I did, but I was trying to fucking swipe that bitch up as soon as I saw it, yeah? As soon as I saw it. But the thing is, yeah, I kept trying to download it, but like, it wouldn't do it. You know like that transaction thing where it like needs to like buffer and shit? It just kept send shitting me back out to the menu. It was like, oh fuck. It was crazy, man. But if you want to upgrade to director's cut, it's six dollars right now. No, it's not even. It's not even that big of a fucking deal. Like, is there actually any new content in the director's cut other than like making the game easier? I've seen like a trailer like a few years ago, and it seemed like there was like some kind of wacky races assault course fucking crazy taxi shit going on. That looked pretty tight, but you know that's not really new story content, but. Who cares? But yeah, dude, I'm not gonna lie, dude. I fired up Death Stranding, yeah, when they gave it away for free. Played that shit for like an hour and a half. Maybe a little bit longer than that. I was enjoying it. I'm not gonna lie to you. I was really enjoying the immersion, being able to just kind of... The walking simulator that is Death Stranding. Using ladders to overcome weird obstacles and shit. It was pretty immersive. I've played the game. I've already completed it. So, like, I've been and done that shit. Got the t-shirt and whatnot. The thing about Death Stranding, yeah... The moment any cutscene would start and they would just try to throw a story at you, I just wanted to fucking shoot myself, dude. There's something about the story in Death Stranding that is just mind-numbing, dude. That being said, I'm very much looking forward to the second game. Hell yeah. <laughs> nothing, out of val nothing of value outside of the art book type stuff? Man, fucking director's cut, bro. What a bunch of uh, baloney, dude. That's some. That's like some arc. That's some. That's some archaic shit, bro. Director's cut, man. What is this? Fucking 1997. Resident Evil, bro. Come on, man. Kojima, what are you doing, bro? But yeah, dude. I I hope you guys had a wonderful Christmas. Little Becca, I hope she had a, a mountain of presents to enjoy. And Mrs. Free Avenger, I hope she had a great one as well. With the with the baby in the oven. <laughs> Merry Christmas, you guys. It was fun. Becca got a pile with one. <laughs> oh, okay, okay. Just got a pile for the one Christmas events to go to. Okay, okay. Awesome. What's that, like a Christmas party with all her friends? That's cool. We always go over budget with her. <laughs> Parents always want the best, you know? Always want the best for their kids and they're always willing to go above and beyond for them. I know how it is. running Christmas with the ML sometime next month. What's the ML? I hope you guys enjoy it. It's like if you're putting on an event there can be some stress involved. I hope the wife isn't driving you crazy. Dude. <laughs> There's a bunch of missions we should do before we get engrossed into the story again because as you guys can see, when I did that lost piece of story content, I just decimated it. <laughs> just absolutely decimated it. Who's played this game? Who played this game back on the PSP, man? Because I'll be real with you. Man, I love this game. <laughs> like, specifically the PSP game. I have it on my shelf. It's literally over there. 
staring at me, dude. I'm a huge Crisis Core fan, man. It's one of my favorite games of all time. That was like... Crisis Core was basically like my... My go-to anime weeb bullshit before I got into Persona. I was... It wasn't even like Final Fantasy VII as a whole. It was pretty much just Crisis Core. Something about Zack Fair really spoke to me. I really, really... Like, love this game. And this character portrayal and all this stuff. Zach's, Zach is such a cool dude. You ever played this shit through Revenge? Jump's good, man. I need that. But this isn't leveling up as much as I'd like it to. I was hoping this would level up already. Oh, you never played this game, dude? Fair enough. Listen, I don't blame you. This game is relatively obscure, even for when it came out. Like, you know, you had to be on the... in the know to know about this game. In a way. Do I even need the regen? I mean, I need a healing spell, you know what I mean? This is like one of the games I like fully just smashed this game into a next level. I like. I was so powerful, dude. I could just walk up to Sephiroth and just throw money at him and he would die. I was. This game was like a true passion project of mine for a long time back in the day. And in a way, it feels so good, dude. It feels so good to finally be happy and excited for the Final Fantasy VII Remake. I mean, I was excited and happy about it to begin with. Especially with all of the implications and weird things that they had uh, conceived and put forward. You know, some weird things that we hadn't really saw or anticipated in a way. I won't go into too many details if you guys like, you know. But yeah, dude, let's just say things didn't really go according to how people thought they would. And it's, it's basically put a huge spanner in the works and it's fascinating. So the Final Fantasy VII community is in a in a is like a live in an uproar, pandemonium. Everyone's happy, everyone's sad. It's like crazy. My nostalgia is being threatened. But my only sentimental attachment to Final Fantasy VII is really specifically this game. Like I tried, well I did not really tried. I did. Like, I like Final Fantasy VII, I think it's pretty sick, and all that, but only complementary to this game. Like, this game just really does bring the whole room together for me. But yeah, Final Fantasy VII's cool. The movie Advent Children's pretty tight. Well, not really. It's very, very laughable and very, very memeable, as you can see, if you've ever looked into it. But... Hey, Zach. So, I enjoyed it. Over. That it is. I'm sure you heard. I ruled. No, I didn't hear. The company reports don't mention you at all. On TV, they only talk about Sephiroth's bravery. But Sephiroth was in B unit. Well, our heroes are chosen by the media. Dreams crushed. I'm trying so hard to enjoy so basically through events if you don't know I mean you probably don't even care but I'm just gonna tell you anyway so this remake of Final Fantasy 7 like the mandate like the time had passed so all of the old cast members the people that played these characters back in the day had all been basically thrown away with the buff war and I'll be honest with you dude it's Zack Fair, the character we're playing as right now, there's something about his old performance, man. I guess I'm just completely nostalgia blind, I suppose. But this new Zack, it's fascinating. Like, I, I'm trying my best to give it the benefit of the doubt, to find things about it that I like. 
But all the things I find that I like about this guy's performance is just shit that reminds me of the old performer. <laughs> but overall, as in the performance, like when he's acting, is terrible, dude. Like the old actor just nails it, bro. Just does so much a better job. When's that mod coming out, bro? Who's working on that shit? Cause I'm, I'm fucking, uh, I want that shit. At least, at least, <laughs> at least it seems I'm not the only one who feels this way. Like, if you look this shit up on, like, the Steam page and, like, you know, scroll down and you look at what people are saying about the game, every, the first thing people say is just like, yeah, dude, it's literally the best remake we could have ever had ever. Like, wow, it's so good. But this guy playing Zack is just makes me sad. <laughs> That's pretty much what everyone said. And I'm right there with him. Seriously, for a remake of a PSP game, it's absolutely staggering. Like, wow. I'm in love right now. <coughs> and it's funny because all the other all the other performers, all the other actors it, are fine. It's just Zack that just is mind-numbing. Listen to my shit. I got that two hit the HP up. That is look how fucking strong I am! I wonder if I can beat that mission now. Oh, that would be sick. So for revenge, uh, there's this like side quest that was giving me issue. I wonder if I can beat it now. I need to take a break though and roll a smoke because you know I'm a fucking <laughs> baby needs his bottle. You know how it is, man. Wait, I did the mission. Yeah, I already did it. That's sick. But yeah, let's 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 take a gander. What we got going? We could probably do that one though. <sighs> we playing Damon X Machina this last week, and it's, and it's also it's all right. Kinda like Armored Core. Yeah, dude, I've played that game. I've even streamed that game. Damon X Machina was... Uh, like, it's a cool game. Like, it genuinely is a very decent game. But, the story is... Shit. I'm not sure if you felt the same thing I did, but there's just way too many speech bubbles on the screen at some point. And it's just like, yeah, man, I've had enough of this fucking story. But, the overall game, the experience, it was fun. Like, genuinely a decent game. I'd be very happy if they made a sequel at some point. But they need to kind of refine their, uh, you know. <laughs> need to refine their, sh their shit a little bit. But yeah, the overall concept, the gameplay mechanics, the way it felt to play was fun, dude. I enjoyed it. Like, dashing around and shit. Like, flying in the sky and then landing again and then doing, like, cartwheels and shit when you're in the air. It's pretty tight. I'd be very curious to see what they do in the future. So, so you agree with me, Brandon? Sweet. At least I'm not. <laughs> at least I'm not like oblivious to like making this shit up. So that's cool. Cool. Uh, what was I gonna do? Oh yeah, I was gonna take a break and roll a, a roll, roll a stogie. If you don't mind. But, let me do a mission first.
Activating combat mode. Out of the way. care if they want to go heavy on narrative but damn most of the start is just repeatedly why is this happening what's going on just questions it over and over and over <laughs> but i haven't even established why i should give a shit yet <laughs> mm -hmm. also they just throw like two dozen characters at you right away if you play one mission with each of them and it's supposed to be or not. I know, right? It's 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 very interesting. I, it's kind of it's the way these game developers approach narrative sometimes is fucking hilarious. Because I'll be honest with you, like I don't think Damon X Machina has a terrible art style. Like the art style is pretty cool. You know, some characters look interesting, I suppose. But yeah, I don't know what they I don't know who they were trying to reach. With that approach to storytelling in Damon X Machina, it just was weird, dude. I can't even remember anything about that game. Literally, cannot. Simply, <laughs> just a complete mind wipe. Someone came at me. Someone came at me with the Men in Black pen, and just fucking. Beep. Can't remember. Jack. Other than the gameplay, the gameplay was cool. That's something. <laughs> you know, I'm actually thinking about playing the PSP version of this game after this. Activating combat mode. Bring it on! Bringing out the big guns! Here we go! Go, go, go! I don't really remember the point is for getting all these like duplicate like duplication spots. Can I like use them and like smash them together and do some bullshit? I don't remember.
Activating combat mode. What the fuck is that? Activating combat mode. You're in for it now. Here we go. Go, go, go. He looks like that dude from uh what the fuck's his name? Let's try again. Activating combat mode. He looks like that dude from uh, A Nightmare Before Christmas or whatever the fuck is who. So as you can see, the side quests, I mean, they're pretty necessary if you want to see the, uh, if you want to see everything the game has to offer, I guess they're pretty necessary. Who the hell is this? Ooh, I I'm probably way too weak to do that though. Boo -doo -boo -doo -boo -boo. <sighs> Yo, so Brandon, we got a plan for the rest of your day, dude. Doing anything? I think you said you're like, uh, Becca's going to a party or something. Be right back. I'm gonna. I gotta go. Uh, roll a. It's it's time for my match in Blaze Green. I'll be right back.
video before ended. I see you have an entire laundry list to do. Good luck with that shirt. Laundry, dishes, Can I adjust my arcade stick? Sounds like you're just making trouble right now, but why are you gonna open up that thing? What do you think that you can achieve that hasn't already been done with that thing? Is it time to readjust some things? I don't know. I, I see me personally, I wouldn't be able to trust myself to really do some of that. So you've been you've been rooting around in there before. And you didn't tighten that bitch up. That's crazy. Or maybe you like basically you tightened it up. But since then, <laughs> you've been using it. And due to that, you know, that usage has made it like, you know, loosey goosey. I could try. I could try getting this lockout switch. You built it, dude. Dude, you're a you're a you're an engineer. What are you, a fucking scientist? It's crazy. Impressive. Most impressive. Ordered the enclosure. The ball buttons, wiring, for myself. Nah, sticks are damn easy. Really? See, you say that, but that's like easy for you. Your idea of easy is like my uh, fucking impossible. Slap go to the PC? Exactly, I ain't go to no fucking PC. People say it's easy, it's like, oh, it's like Legos, just open that shit up. I'm nah, nah, I ain't doing that. And void the warranty? <laughs> I ain't opening that shit up. Alright. Dee has been acquired. Let's continue our quest, shall we? Well, what are we doing anyway? Building a PC. Activating combat mode. Hey, Brandon. You said you got a bunch of shit to do, but I hope you're not stressed out about it. Conflict resolved. Oh yeah. Good luck and all that. Laundry. Going to Barnes and Noble. The hell is that? I've heard of that. I've only ever heard of that shit like on like podcasts or something. Is that like uh, like a furniture store or something? Grocery shopping, probably the library. You go to the library? <laughs> I 
That is cool. Hey, man. Activating combat mode. Gotcha. Right, time to burn that gun, huh? Oh, yeah. Conflict resolved. Yeah. Conflict resolved. Activating combat mode. You got any drink in mind, dude? See, I got some for Christmas. Brace yourself. My mother got me. The stakes been one. Trying to kill me? What the fuck? Activating combat mode. Conflict resolved. 
find it really funny that Zack can do a Psycho Crusher. Isn't that sick? But to differentiate it, he doesn't need to do a charge input, he just does the fucking uppercut input and that shit comes out. It's ridiculous, I know. Activating combat mode. See, that's how Zack sounds, you know what I mean? In this game, it sounds like one of those like, big beanie! Like, but like, he sounds like that unironically. Now, now it drives me it. nuts. One blow, alright? Bring out the big guns! Concentrate. I'm feeling it! Son of the Hedgehog, That's the best part. <sighs> and I really want to do this shit, but these guys are rough. They've been kicking my fucking Jesus. What the hell is this? I don't remember what this does. Who cares? <coughs> Excuse me. Maybe we should do some more story. I have an idea. Before we continue, let's go and explore. Like, let's go see if there's any like new quests around. You know what I mean? Like, uh, it's like Loveless Avenue and all that bullshit. Congratulations. As of this moment, you are promoted to soldier first class. Huh. I thought I'd be happier. Understandable. Too much happened too fast. Zack, I'm afraid I need your assistance again. Are you pushing another assignment on me? My apologies. Whatever. I'll fill you in, Zack. But before that, go to the briefing room and change into a first-class uniform.
Are you Zek? In the flesh. As soldier first class, you are now authorized to use Materia Fusion. Whoa! So what do I do? First, open the main menu. You should now be able to select Materia Fusion. Now, try fusing these two Materia. That should give you a general idea of how the process works. If you have any questions, just let me know. Hey now, are you sure you know enough about Materia Fusion? Materia Fusion is still a new technology. Some combinations and results have not been tried or discovered yet. That's why we want you to experiment. And if you make a new discovery, let us know. Finish changing? Yeah, and I picked up Materia Fusion too. Then return to my office. I'll brief you on the mission. Yes, sir. Party Daytonas are so cool, right? When I grow up, I'm gonna get one and tear it up on the highway. Wow, what an amazing airship. I'm amazed that Shinra can make something like this fly through the skies. running a special on potions. The general public still has to pay full price. But for soldier members and sh how about you, sir? Would
This is Sector 8. If you, if you, from the... I can't believe that Genesis was killed in action. Rest in peace, my sweet prince. Your search for the true meaning of the Loveless text will be carried on by we in the study group. You, sir, how about you? Would you like to study Genesis's Bible Loveless with the study group? Welcome. You are now a fellow worshiper of Loveless. Oh. It looks like you've got new mail. Why don't you take a look? Loveless is an epic poem from the days of old, whose final act has never been discovered. Therefore, literary experts always get into heated debates about their interpretations of the final act. I was deeply affected by Genesis's interpretations. You could say my personal passion for Loveless was ignited by Genesis. I've been waiting for the train for quite a while now, but it still hasn't come in yet. Lately, there's been a lot of delays. Shinra Railway's new locomotive is pulling in soon! Its model name is the Mark 93-2! I can't wait to see it! Oh man, I'm so pumped! I came to see the new Shinra train with my big brother! I can't wait to see it! Oh man, I'm so pumped! Get up. Are you with that Shinra outfit, Soldier? Yeah, I'm with Soldier. Name's Zack. <laughs> you Shinra people are so arrogant. So I'm hearing through the grapevine that hordes of monsters have been seen around Midgar and Calm. Around Midgar? Huh? You didn't know about this? And you're with Soldier? Then here's something you should know. The study of planet life speaks of the legend of weapons, guardians of the planet. When they sense the planet is in danger, they rise to destroy that which ills the planet. And this relates to the monsters how? That which ills the planet. Sounds like they're talking about the Shinra company to me. <laughs> Good story, bro. They're just monsters. Weapons, you say? Come on. <laughs> Go ahead, laugh it up while you can. A memorial, a farewell gathering. 
suffering for Genesis? No! I can't accept it! I can't stay still anymore! I have to keep running forever! According to Shinra news, both Angeal and Genesis have been killed in action, which proves that Soldier's Greatest is Sephiroth! Right now, I'm in pursuit of one of those reporters. Please don't talk. If you get lost, go to the Information Center, sir. The ladies at the Information Center can help you with anything you need to know, sir. Congratulations on your promotion to first class. Lately, you're like the talk of the town. And it's all good. Oh, Zack! You finally made first class! Oh, man. I'm so jealous. Now that you're first, the ladies oh, will be all over you. What? You made first? Damn, what a nightmare. How can I let Zack overtake me? Oh, no, it's nothing. Congrats, that's great. The training room is currently being used for top secret research. Hence, entry is strictly prohibited. It is off limits even for you, Mr. Soldier. But I, being the coward that I am, cannot muster thus whether to enter or not ah there you are now let us begin the experiment huh experiment me never mind just make your way to the training room not without knowing what for you wouldn't understand it if I told you anyway. But I want to verify the virtual data gathered from a soldier operative's combat results. You are going to help me validate my data by participating in a simulated combat scenario. data. Defeat this sample and prove my greatness to the entire world. Did you say something? No, nothing. Now we begin. Activating combat mode. Ah! See ya! Holy oh, yeah. result! No, this can't be. With the settings off again, 
Or maybe I'm just playing better than your data? <laughs> to make such a bold claim, you need to provide more solid data. Fight this next monster and prove your superiority to me. Against these new settings, you will be... <laughs> Say again? Oh, nothing. Now, let's begin. Activating combat mode. Out of the way! This is impossible. We're the settings off yet again. You see? That's what soldier can do. Second rate soldier, maybe. No, third rate. If you truly are first rate, then fight my next data. Prove to me that you can win. Not everyone can become an elite warrior like Sephiroth. Huh? What? Oh, nothing. Now, let's begin. It appears that you have the talent to become a fine study sample. Not really a talent I want. You should be proud. Samples like you only appear every two years or so. Yay. By the by, I have an extra special program you can fight. Interested? Extra special program? Some data I designed on a lark that displays power inconceivable in reality. Professor Hojo, you can't possibly mean to use that data on a human. Not that one. It's way too dangerous. It would be a worthy opponent for a first-rate operative. <laughs> Such as yourself. I'm warning you, don't do this. I agree. It may cost you your... Are you with the anti-Hojo lot? The ultimate virtue. Hey. I agree. <laughs> You are indeed a sample worthy of my attention. You need not worry. I will see to it that your remains contribute greatly to science. Now, my precious virtual data, prove my greatness to the entire world.
is most unexpected. Wait. I formulated a new hypothesis. Uh, you were saying something about my remains? Yes. My knowledge, ability, and inspiration have forged a new path. You and I will share a special relationship. Did you hear me? Activating combat mode.
combat mode. Your honor to me. Oh, Come yeah. To result. Activating combat mode.
Activating combat mode.
right now, we are running a special on potions. How about you?
Right now, we are running at the jet. Combat mode.
Activating combat mode. Can't have them calling for backup. I'll draw their attention. Make sure you take them out. Yeah, you got it. Brace yourself. Is this the end? No, not if I can help it.
Right now, we are running a special on potions. The general public still has to pay for how about... The company has decided to eliminate Genesis and his cohorts. This includes Angeal as well. And you want me to do it? No. The Shinra army will handle it. What about me? They don't trust you. They believe your emotions will hamper your judgment. <laughs> well, of course! That's why I'm going too. To kill them? Where? Close. Sephiroth, the president. Zack, entrance. Yeah, you got it.
the... It stopped? Soldiers here! Thank goodness! Hurry up and deal with that! That? Whoa! What is this? Activating combat mode. What was that? What? You don't know? That was an intruder neutralization mech. So why was it attacking employees? It just went... But I was ordered to go to the entrance. 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 Shinra weapons attacking the Shinra building! Is this Genesis is doing? Activating combat mode. Off. The intruders are Genesis copies. There's no doubt. This is Hollander's doing. Who is that? A Shinra scientist who stole the copy tech, then vanished. Are you saying that this Hollander and Genesis are working together? Quite possibly. Do you know what they're planning? Hollander sought to head the science department and lost. He's borne a grudge against Shinra ever since. He wants revenge. So petty. And Genesis is supporting the stupid cause? I don't want to believe it. Well, then don't. Agreed. Now, Zack. Copies have been sighted in Sector 8 as well. Let's go. <laughs> this is bad. We should split up. Good call. Hold on, I'm a coming. <sighs> Sector eight is Turk's jurisdiction, slick. You've got to be kidding me! Sung, do something! There's no need for concern. Huh? Okay. 
the other areas. Midgar's just crawling with nasties. Soldiers having difficulties. Reno, rude. Just say the word. Go. Yes, sir. <laughs> So now we're outsourcing to the Turks. Soldiers being stingy. There's a manpower shortage. Duh. You're a Turk too? I'm Sisney. I'm Zach. Pleasure to meet you. Zach, aren't you on assignment? <laughs> Same objective. Need some help here? I appreciate the offer. Oh, but... how generous. Well, Sung, Zach. I gotta go. Genesis! No! They're copies? Activating combat mode! Ah. 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 Better run for it! You can do it, Zach! When I was a kid, I always wanted to have wings. You know, like an angel. If people had wings, they'd be monsters. Wings symbolize freedom for those who have none. They don't symbolize monsters. Soldier first class, you've got skill. 
Well, unlike the Turks, fighting's our main thing. Here, a little gift for helping me out. All right then, I'm off to the next job. You've got something too, right? Yeah, I do. Until we meet again. Once Sector 8 is clear, come to Mako Reactor 5. Did you find something out? Angeal has been sighted. <sighs> so it's search and destroy? The army is mobilizing, but there's still time. You and I will find them before they we do. And? And what? Fail. To eliminate them. For real? <laughs> yes. For real. Awesome! We're gonna fail! Is that Angeal's face? It appears Genesis isn't the only one who can be copied. The company training room. Hmm? We used to sneak in there for fun. When the seconds were out. Genesis. And Gio. And I. You guys were pretty tight. Hmm. I wonder. Infinite in mystery is the gift of the goddess. We seek it thus and take to the sky. Ripples form on the water's surface. The wandering soul knows no rest. Loveless, Act One. <laughs> you remember. How can I not, when you've beaten it into my head? Don't take Sephiroth lightly. <laughs> no good. you can do all hail Sephiroth huh and Jill stay back I'll take Sephiroth alone Genesis the world needs a new hero <laughs> come and try so smug but for how long <laughs> Yeah! <laughs> 
Stop! You'll destroy this place. That's no way to talk to a hero! My way! Genesis! Just a scrape. I'll be fine. Don't worry. Even if tomorrow is barren of promises, nothing shall forestall my return. So, was everything all right? Yes. As far as Genesis was concerned. But... As for Angeal... Angeal? What happened? Later, I received one of his famous lectures. About what? Always the same. Discipline, dreams, honor, etc. Haha. <laughs> one of those, huh? So it's true. They're in league with Hollander. How could this happen? Angeal, what are you up to? Where are you? Got him! 
Hollander's laboratory is right down this way. It's a private, unsanctioned facility. We may find leads on Angeal. All right, let's go. Activating combat mode. isn't receiving power. The source is... Zack, open the valve on the lowest level. That should open the door.
Activating combat mode. Yeah. Huh? Good work. How wretched. There's a monster inside. Is this where they make the copies? I'm getting woozy. It was shortly before Genesis left. The wound was superficial, but for some reason, Genesis wasn't healing. The man who treated him was Hollander. Professor Hollander, how is Genesis? The problem is the Mako energy that seeped in through the wound. Is it treatable? First, he'll need a transfusion. You aren't viable. Why couldn't I be the donor?
a soldier, type G. It was Hollander's experiment. The result was a normal child, which meant he failed. However, get your bearings. These are highly classified research documents taken from the science department. Project G, degradation, and ancients. Hmm, interesting. You should take a look. Project G gave birth to the man we know as Genesis. Project G. Project Genesis. Contrary to this report, Genesis showed clear signs of change. Degrading? Not only that. Copies? Hmm. Abominations. Sephiroth. Hollander, I thought I'd find you here. You want to do something to me, eh? But then, who will stop Genesis and Angeal's degradation? Genesis. You won't take Hollander. <clears throat> Zack, go. Yeah. <clears throat> there is no hate, only joy, for you are beloved by the goddess. Hero of the dawn, healer of worlds. Loveless again, you never change. Three friends go into battle. One is captured, one flies away. The one that is left becomes a hero. A common story. If we were to enact it, would I be the one to play the hero or would you? It's all yours. Indeed. After all, your glory should have been mine. How petty. In hindsight, perhaps. Now what I want most is the gift of the goddess. You won't get away. Where is Angeal? Tell me! Activating combat mode. Activating combat mode.
pure honor to me. I got it. Hollander, do you understand what you're doing? <gasps> Working for Hollander now? What is it you're after? World domination. That's not even funny, man. How about revenge? For what? And deal! I've become a monster. A monster's objective is usually world domination or revenge. You're wrong. Those aren't the wings of a monster. Well then, what are they? Angel's wings. I see. Then what should an angel fight for, Zack? What do angels dream of? Angel. Angels dream of one thing. Please, tell me. To be human. Defend yourself! Tell me what happened. Mom? I... I want to help out a friend. But I don't know how I can do it. Hello? M Mom? Hello? Hooray! Heaven? Not quite. It's a church. Hey. Hmm? An angel? No, I'm Aerith. You fell from the sky. Huh? Scared me. So you saved me, huh? Not really. Hello? That's all I did. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much, Aerith. I'm Zack. I have to repay you somehow. Don't worry about it. No, no. Hmm. Aha! Hey, how about one date? What is that? Don't be silly. Uh... <sighs> Stop! Don't step on the flowers. Excuse me? Normally, 
people are more careful with flowers. Well, I guess I'm not normal. Oh. You don't see a lot of flowers in Midgar. They're like luxury items around here. They only grow here. Although, I planted some outside my house, too. <laughs> if I were you, I'd sell them. Hmm? Midgar is full of flowers, your wallet's full of money. Midgar full of flowers, wallet full of money? Never thought of it that way. The exit? That door. Going already? Then look at the flowers. Are you always here? Yeah. So, where are you going? Hmm. Don't know. I'll take you. Where? No. You just want to spend more time with me. <laughs> yeah. Huh? What? Uh, <laughs> We're under the plate, right? Sector five, the slums. Yeah. Main Street's over... that way. There's lots of people. And you can go above. Ah. Well, I should be good once I make it there. All right? Lead the way. Okay, let's go. would grow here? There we go. Zach, let's run! Don't worry about it. I'll protect you. I've got this. You've got this? Oh yeah. Stay back, okay? Activating combat mode. <laughs> Strong. <laughs> Strong. Like a monster, right? Zack? What's wrong? Nothing. Now, let's move. Hey, I looked good, right? Hmm. Hmm. What?
Dunno. Come on, flatter me. <laughs> All right, Zach. Let's go. Uh, uh, hello. Shouldn't we get going? More mo Hey, wait! So, here we are. Yep. Hmm. Something wrong? The slums look just like any other town. <laughs> Of course. Lots of people live here. Hey, inside that gate, there's a market. There's so many great shops there. The market's this way. It's kind of stuffy here. You okay? Huh? I know why. There's no sky here. Uh, we don't need the sky. You're under this plate all the time. You normally miss seeing the sky, no? Sorry, I'm not normal. How's that? The sky frightens me, like it's sucking me in. Weird, right? Normal is overrated. You think so? I know. One day, I'll show you a pretty sky. It won't be scary. Trust me, you're gonna love it. Looks like an interesting place. Yeah. Wanna take a look? Oh! Oh, sorry. Be careful, huh? Okay. Sorry again. Man, that hurts. Huh? Wait. What the? What's wrong? My wallet's gone. <gasps> oh no! That little brat! He just stole my wallet! Aerith, wait here, okay? I'm gonna go catch that kid and get my wallet back! Bruno's his name. Bruno? You know his name? Yeah, I know him. Just a little. He doesn't do things like that. But... If he really stole from you, I'm sure he had good reason. Hey! I'll go look for him. Zach, you wait here. Mm. All right, I'll wait here. But I'm pretty antsy. Yeah, I know. That obvious? <laughs> theft is theft. 
No matter the reason, I'll have to give him a good scolding. Ugh, that's it. It's my wallet that was stolen. I'm gonna look for Bruno too. I think he went that way. If you need materia, you've come to the right place. Everything from top of the... If you need materia... I am a carpenter that travels all over the world. I keep my materials here, so hands off. Anything from gifts for your loved ones to common, everyday use items. If you need accessories, get them right here. Did he go out from here? Hey, you there! Did a kid come running this way? A little boy? A little boy? Don't know. Although, children never come this way. I see. Got your pocket pick, did you? Uh huh? Happens all the time here. But you're gonna have a hard time finding the thief on your own. Ask folks around here nicely, and they might help you. Yeah, that's a good point. Right. I'll ask around here, for starters. Let me think. I just saw a boy running frantically by the accessory shop. Y you Oh, no. Never mind. I'm just a Shinra trooper on patrol. Y you Oh, no. Hey, excuse me. I'm looking for a little boy named Bruno. He looks like this. I haven't seen... Wait, I did see him! Really? That way, I think. That way? Yes, yes, way down there! Great, thanks. D hey! Wait! He's over by you! <sighs> He's gone! Hey, lady! What gives? <laughs> I didn't mean to trick you. I just have really bad eyesight. Come on, man. Zach! Hey, Aerith. Did you find him yet? Not yet, but... Give me time, please? Hey there. I'm looking for someone. A little boy named Bruno. Yeah, I know Bruno. You must want to find him badly. I'll bring him here for you, okay? You will? Yeah, stay right here. All right, I'll be waiting. Hmm. Ugh, that's it. How far did she have to go? Huh? Hey! That's the kid who took... Oh, no. You talked too soon. 
You know, I was just about to catch him. Weren't you trying to help him get away? No, I wasn't. That's so mean. <laughs> Come on, man. I wonder if Aerith is still looking. All by herself. Hey, kid, was it you who took my wallet, by any chance? Oh, come on. You saw. I've been here the whole time. Oh, yeah. You're right. I'm sorry. It's fine. You got pickpocketed, right? If you're looking for the guy, I'll help you out. Well, I have some leads I can give you, but you have to give me a potion in exchange. You're a broker? You can't get something for nothing, mister. But trust me, my information's good. Thank you. Oh, hey, he's right behind you, mister. Huh? What gives? He's gone. Hey, if you know where he might go, tell me. Huh? I just gave you some information? If you want to know more, give me another item. Give me a break. Thank you. Oh, look, there. Really? Uh, where? Hey, kid, that wasn't the information you just sold me, was it? Hey, you catch on fast. Are you ready to buy some more? Not on your life. Come on, man. Oh, I see. I'll come back. Hmm? Hey, Aerith. Zack! Did you find him yet? Um, no. But give me more time. I'll find him. Aerith, how goes? Zack. <laughs> There's no need to look so worried. It's just bad luck. Hey, why don't we look together? Uh, but... Don't worry about it. I'm not gonna yell at him straight from the top. I'll ask him why he did it. And I'll forgive him if it was for a good reason. Really? Yes, really. Okay, let's go look. Yeah, but we still have no leads. If Bruno needed money, he should still be around here. Yeah. Then you stay here and keep an eye out. I'll go take a look around town. Let's try that, okay? He didn't go... Hey, mister. You look... Aha! I found you! Uh Okay, no more running. Finally! All right, you know what you did was bad, don't you? You should never steal from people. Zack? <sighs> because it's very, very wrong. Now, tell me why you did it. None of your business. What you... <clears throat> Bruno, did you really steal? Yes. I see. So, why did you do that? Mm. 
You know, Aerith believed in you. No matter what I said, she insisted you're a good boy. You can shut me out, but tell Aerith the truth. Do you need money? Tell me why. I need medicine, but my wallet was eaten by a monster. That's why I took this guy's wallet. I thought, if he's your friend, he might give me a break. Bruno, this was bad. You know that. Don't do it again. Okay. Okay, good. Now we're friends again. Zach, you agree? You believe in him, so yes. Thank you. I'm sorry. But you need medicine, right? Yeah. It's for my grandpa. <gasps> really? Zach, are you sure? Yeah. Buy it with my money, okay? Thanks so... Wait! It's no good! There's not enough here! Seriously? Okay, I'll get your money back from the monster. But it's dangerous. Don't you worry. Monsters around here are cake. Okay, but I'm going too. No, it'll be fine. Just let me handle it. Stay here and wait with Bruno. The monsters should still be on the path that goes to the park, I think. Here's your wallet and money. There was only a little money in there to begin with. I didn't spend any. Okay, okay, I got it. <sighs> um, the park is this way. Hey, you! Get back inside the gate now! Hmm? Monsters! Coming out of the park in droves! The park? All right, that's gotta be them. It's not all right! Everyone's fled! It's dangerous. You have to turn back now. Sorry, but they owe me some money. So I have to go over and collect. What? What the hell are you talking about, guy? Relax, relax. Don't worry about me. You know, you should get behind that gate yourself. Here we go. This is them. Bruno's wallet, here I come. Activating combat mode. Take that! Combat resolved. Oh yeah! Oh, here we are. One wallet. Is the money still inside? Whoa! That's way more than I have. Wow! You really got it back! Amazing! Ugh! It's so sticky! Stop complaining. At least you got it back. Zach, were you okay? No problem at all. Piece of cake. Thanks a lot, mister. Call me Zach. If you need more help, just ask. You don't need to steal anymore. Hmm. Thanks, but you've got bigger money problems than me. <sighs> well, maybe so. But hey, just you wait. Aerith and I, we're gonna make a fortune. Huh? We're launching Operation Midgar Full of Flowers, Wallet Full of Money. <laughs> yeah.
Yes, Midgar, full of flowers, and Wallet, full of money. Aerith, for real? Yeah, for real. That's why, if you're in trouble, we can help you. All right, I'll come talk to you. Okay, mister, Aerith, thanks. Hey, Zack, did you mean it? Selling the flowers? Of course. There's no turning back after this. I know. Let's make a wagon. A wagon? Yes, a flower wagon. With a wagon to carry lots of flowers, you could sell them all over Midgar. Hmm. Oh, not feeling it? No, no, it's great. Let's do it. with your boyfriend today? Mm -mm. I just met him. Hey, weren't you chasing a kid around here earlier? I heard about you from the local townsfolk. I thought you were some shady outsider, but it looks like you're a decent guy. Sorry I misjudged you. Here, take this olive branch. I have to say though, Aerith, you found yourself a pretty nice fella. No, no, not a boyfriend. I just met him today. Oh, wait, could we take a look? Huh? You came out to go shopping? Okay, forget it. Uh, 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 no, no, I'm joking. Go take a look. Thank you, just a look. I'll be quick. Do you like this store? Yeah, it's fun just looking. Hey, Aerith. Uh-huh? To pay you back for that hello, I'll buy you something. <laughs> Your offer was one date, no? But then you said, don't be silly, remember? Well, I... Okay, a memento for today. You mean it? Of course. <laughs> okay. I want this. All right, it's yours. Hold on. How's that? Does it look right? Uh, I think so. Yeah, it looks great. Thank you, Zack. I'll treasure this. Yeah. Hey, do you still have time? I guess so. Why? Wanna go to the park? Hey, that sounds like a date. Yeah. Come on, let's go. So, ever meet any soldier members? Maybe. Do you think that they're happy? What do you mean? Heroes to children. Protectors of the peace. But they're not normal. They get some kind of special surgery. Don't they? So they say. Normal is best. I think so, at least. Those soldier people are kind of... weird. They're... weird, huh? And they're... scary. They fight. And they love it. Actually, I'm with Soldier. <gasps> I'm sorry.
So pretty. The face? <laughs> the eyes. You like them? Then take a closer look. Eyes infused with Mako energy. A soldier trademark. Oh, you. <laughs> Color of the sky, right? Uh-huh. But not scary at all. I'll admit, things haven't been normal at all lately. What about you, Aerith? How's your life going? <laughs> I was thinking it would be a normal day. But then suddenly... Some guy fell out of the sky. That's not all that bad. <laughs> oh. Zack, return to the Shinra building now. Genesis has attacked us. <sighs> On my way. I'm sorry, but duty calls. Well, I guess I should get going then. Will I see you again? Of course. I hope that your friend's okay, Zack. Huh? You talk in your sleep. Yeah. It'll be fine. I know that now. To get to the Shinra building, I have to go through the market, they said. Huh. Looks like we've got more monsters. Activating combat mode. Bring it on! Conflict resolved. Oh yeah! Activating combat mode. Conflict resolved. Later! Damn it. Stupid delivery service. There's materia missing again. They must have dropped them. Oh. Say, friend. 
You look pretty quick on your feet. Oh, yeah. I had a feeling about you. Now, how'd you like to do a job for me? You just need to collect material you find on the street. It's really easy. Won't take long at all. All right, let's get started. To make things easier for you, I asked everyone in the neighborhood to stay indoors. So use those fast legs and go get some materia. I see you found all 20 min- Your time is... not- So anyway... All right. I am a carpenter that- Anything from gifts, if you need- uh, There's- oh. You just- All right, to make- So you- I see so so all right maybe I should
Activating combat mode. Activating combat mode. Activating 
in combat mode. That's the last of the monsters. Now, where's that treasure? Ah, found it! What? The wanted treasures kept secret. Ugh. Two, to deliver dreams to her homeland. Ugh. Three, make way, cause here she comes. I, the treasure princess, hear me roar! Hey. You're that weird kid I met in Wu Tai. Sucker! What were you expecting? You soldier perv! What? I'm no sucker, and I'm certainly no perv. My name is Zack. So, what are you lost or something? You want me to take you home? I'm not lost! I'm here to take your treasure! All of it! For the glory of Wu Tai! Get ready! Why don't you just admit that you're lost? Be honest. <laughs> Treasure quest... <laughs> ...failed. <laughs> Wait, I made her cry? Did I do something wrong? Should I have humored her little game a bit more? Also, who the heck is she?
take out enemies with one blow. Now, do it. One blow, all right? I could use a demo. Fine, let's do this. Yes, got it in one blow. That one was too weak. Now, again. Bring out the big guns. Concentrate. I'm feeling it.
That's the last of the monsters. Now, where's that treasure? Ah, found it! Zoom, 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 zoom! Ha! Zoom, 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 zoom! Yeah! She got me. Combat mode. Oh, yeah. 
assault. Like that's the last of the monsters. Now, where's that treasure? Ah, found it. What? Seriously? <sighs> she got me. Looks like that's the last of the monsters. Now, where's that treasure? Ah, found it! Oh, not again! Ah, little brat! Oh, yeah. 
Activating combat mode. Looks like that's the last of the monsters. Now, where's that treasure? Ah, found it! Gotcha! No, oh, that little brat! She thinks because I feel bad for making her cry, she can do whatever? Next time I see her, she's gonna pay!
Activating combat mode.
Resolve. Activating combat mode. Activating combat mode. Bring it on.
Activating combat mode. Looks like that's the last of the monsters. Now, where's that treasure? Ah, found it! One, through the embers of a war not won. Uh, Two, to restore her homeland's glory. Three, up from the rubble and ash. <clears throat> the treasure princess is here at last. Yes, at last. Wutai's Goat Ninja, Yuffie Kisaragi. Hey, you, stop doing this. You could get hurt. I'm humoring you, but not everyone is as understanding. Silence! For Wutai's glory, I'm taking all your treasure. Get ready! Okay, fine. You steal treasure, but you should really work on your technique. You're still too green to take anything from me. <laughs> Treasure quest... <laughs> ...failed. <laughs> you know, if you have to steal, develop better methods. <laughs> oh, great. I made her cry again. Well then, I'll have to play along again. Oh. How did she get my mail address? Oh, yeah. 
solved. All right. Looks like that's the last of the monsters. Now, where's that treasure? Ah, found it. One. Wu Tai's woes weigh heavily. No. Two. Endless training weighs heavier. Three. All in the name of defeating Shinra. Yeah. Wu Tai's glory is in my hands. Today, I finally defeat Shinra. Yes, yes, it's all very impressive. I knew that mail was from you. Oh, how do you know my mail address? You want to know the truth? Yes, I do. Then why don't you check your mail? What, now? Yeah, just take your phone out of your pocket and... Hey, what gives? Sorry, but no dice. You thought you could steal something from me while I was busy looking at my phone. Didn't you? I'm not falling for that. So, how did you get it? My mail address? You will tell me this time. <laughs> Treasure quest... <laughs> Failed. <laughs> Man, she really can't turn it on like a faucet. Hey, I never learned how she got my mail address.
combat mode. yourself. combat mode. Bring it on! 
Activating combat mode. Out of the way. Activating combat mode. Activating combat mode. Activating combat mode.
Activating combat mode. This is the slums. Something wrong? It's just really cluttered. So you don't like it? Just the opposite. I'm right at home. Hooray! I knew you'd say that, Zack. Is that really a good thing? Brace yourself! Good luck. Thanks. Looks like that's the last of the monsters. Now, where's that treasure? Ah, found it! I gave you the information on that item, you know. If you want to get that item, leave a hundred gil. No. Whoa, that gave me a start. So it was her. Well, I could have guessed. She's always going on about restoring Wu Tai. I guess I could spare a hundred gil for that.
All right, let's do this thing. Hey! Hmm? Oh, hey, Bruno. Mister, you're leaving? It's a good thing I caught you. Here, I wanted to give you this materia before you go. I promise I'll never steal again. That's why I want you to keep this for me. Hey, good for you, kid. I'm glad I was a good one. Mister, don't use that materia to do bad things. Of course not. Well, never mind that. There was one more thing I wanted to say. Mister, you need to work a lot harder to be worthy of Aerith. Well, where is this coming from? Between you and me, I'm pretty sure Aerith is really sweet on you, mister. Well, I'm rooting for you, okay? If you need help, come talk to me, okay? See ya! Hmm. Looks like I gained a lot of trust. Well, I'll hold on to this materia then. Life's just not that simple. Yeah, yeah, no need to remind me. <sighs> that stung. A cut above the usual riffraff, are we? Ha! No problem. Activating combat mode. <laughs>
Is that it? That's it, right? Right, I'm off. I need your help. Do you? Honestly, what are you thinking, Angeal? I'm not really sure myself. <laughs> At times I feel as if my mind is mired in fog. But Zack, no matter what happens, I have to protect my honor. As long as I hold, the Buster Sword. Zack, join my battle. Our enemy is all that creates suffering. All right. I'll help you. I'll carry you there. No, wait, I... Flying feels pretty good. Sorry. You're late. Sephiroth, you are thin. <laughs> On to business. I'm certain Hollander has ordered Genesis to eliminate Hojo. Hojo? As in... Yes. The director of the Shinra Science Department. Hollander believes Hojo robbed him of his rightful position. Then their target has to be the Science Department upstairs. Forget about Hojo. Same old Sephiroth. Fine. Then you take the lower levels. I'll go outside. Zack, go up. I leave Hojo to you. You got it! What is Angeal up to exactly? Right now, I don't have a clue. But, we're fighting together again. That's good enough for now. All right, the science department is this way. Sir, are you... Good! You're safe! Can you please be quiet? Hey, the building is under attack by Genesis. Their target might be you, Professor. And so... You are my protection? Anyway, can you come with me, please? <laughs> Degrading monsters are nothing to fear. Uh, are you talking about Genesis? Indeed I am. A memento from a bygone era, when men could deem any unclassified life form an ancient. 
unclassified life form? The Celestial Calamity, Genova. Uh... You need not know of it. Soldier's duty is not to think. Just follow your orders and protect me. Whoa, looks complicated. What? What's that noise? What you just did was release test sample monsters onto the lower floor. Monsters? Too ferocious to be of any use. I was about to get rid of them. <laughs> Such timing. I charge you with their disposal. What, me? <laughs> I will tell you something interesting. The detention cells on 67 are being used to store items. The monsters you just released each hold a key for those item storage cells. Those storage cells may be holding some useful items. If you're interested, Try to get the keys from the monsters. However, how you take the keys from the monsters, you'll need to figure out yourself. Honestly, I don't find that very interesting at all. Even if you fail, there is no need for concern. After three minutes, a tranquilizer gas will be released. Did you hear me? If you dispose of the monsters within three minutes, I will not report that you were responsible for the accident. Okay, sounds good. But tranquilizer gas, you say? Is it gonna tranquilize me as well? You won't need to worry if you finish within three minutes. This will be a good test to see if you truly are soldier. Must be the samples. Hey, where are you going? Whoa, 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 whoa! My eval and soldier pride is at stake. Come back here, man. They're scattered all over the place. Gotta take them out fast. So I can take the items in the cells, right? The monsters have the keys to... Here I come! Activating combat mode. Conflict resolved. Oh yeah! There you are! Activating combat mode. Take that! Conflict resolved. Oh yeah! Here we can- 
Activating combat mode. Bring it on. Conflict resolved. Oh, yeah. There you are. Activating combat mode. Conflict resolved. Oh, yeah. Still have some time. That's all of them. There's still time, but I have no keys. Can't go item hunting. So I took out all the samples, but I still don't have any cell keys. Huh. Okay, better head back. <sighs> Professor, cleaning's done. You disposed of all the samples. I suppose I must accept you as first. About time. <laughs> I was able to acquire some intriguing data. The items you picked up are yours. But I locked all the cells once again. No more exploring for you. I must say, this is very interesting data. <laughs> That's my data. Don't use it for evil. You seem purposeless. Well, no. I have a purpose. I thought you said I would have some visitors. Are you prepared to sacrifice your own life to protect this great intellect of mine? Well, I... Of course you can count on me! Come and get it, is what I say! I'll show them the power of the next generation of soldier firsts. <laughs> that is most encouraging. Don't lose against some failed project by a second-rate scientist. Oh? Well, look who's here. Hollander sent you, correct? You think that if you obey Hollander, he'll stop your body from degrading. Is that it? Pitiful. Just pitiful, I say. Genesis. <laughs> a second-rate hack like Hollander couldn't cure a cold. Genesis, that's enough. Ah. What do we have here? My friend, the fates are cruel. There are no dreams. No honor remains. The arrow has left. The bow of the goddess. The entire cast of Hollander's freak show. Shut up, you! Loveless, Act 4. Where the two friends challenge each other to a duel. An ancient epic, 
I read it thinking it might aid my research, but pure drivel. How does the duel end? Unknown. The last act is missing, and yet to be discovered. There are various theories. The mysterious gift of the goddess. What is the meaning behind it? For us, at least. Hey! Hold it, Genesis! My soul corrupted by vengeance. hath endured torment to find the end of the journey in my own salvation and your eternal slumber. He's summoning again! Zack, I leave this to you. Huh? You can do this. Trust me. Uh, don't leave me here! Stop! Come back! Uh. Aerith? Listen, can I call you back later? I have some company. Don't keep your guest waiting, she says. Activating combat mode. Where did everyone go? Come on, pick up! Who are you calling? Sephiroth. I just can't seem to get a hold of him. Oh, haven't you heard? Word is, Sephiroth has shut himself inside the data room. In the data room, communication devices are strictly prohibited. It's no wonder you can't reach him. The data room? Apparently. He's researching the history of the Shinra Science Department. Oh. Aerith, what's up? Um, question. When are you going to make it for me? Make what? No! 
the flower wagon. You forgot? No, of course I didn't. Hold on, I'm coming. Right now, we are running, the general public still has to pay full price. But, for soldier members and Shinra troops, they are currently free. How about you, sir? Would you like one? Angeal? Where have you been? Sorry. I've been a little busy. Yeah, great. Can't reach Sephiroth either. What's going on? Nothing. He's just cooped up in the data room, looking into stuff in the past or something. I see. Whoa! You're taking off? What did you come here for? Genesis and Hollander are in Modeoheim now. Oh. You're reporting. So you're still... working? <laughs> I'm still a soldier member in spirit. I've informed Lazard. They'll pick you up. Zack, I need you in Modeoheim. I know. Just give me a minute. Aerith isn't there. Mm. Problem? And how is it you know Aerith? It's complicated. Really? Did she tell you anything? Not a thing. Then, I won't either. Whatever, I guess. Whatever.
Well, that's a fine how do you do. Song! Hey guys! No signal out here. Well, at least we're all in one piece. We'll be all right. Thankfully, we have someone used to this kind of terrain. Yeah, yeah, I'm a country boy. All right then. We would have reached Modeoheim by now if we hadn't crashed. So, we're going to need to make up for lost time. All right. Follow me then.
Testing, one, two, three. Hello? Mama Bear, do you read me? <sighs> guys, uh, I'm back, by the way. I just wanted to touch base with you guys before we get back into the game. But, uh, how's everyone doing? Hope you guys are having a good one. Just made some microwave pork chops and ended up... Ended up like pork rinds, porn rinds. Hmm. Dio, I salute you, my good man, my friend. You're a braver man than I. I, for one, not too keen on pork. <laughs> I try not to eat it whenever I can, but uh, fucking yeah, man, that sucks. But as long as you can eat it, I mean, if you can eat it, and, you know, I hope that you can still fucking enjoy that shit. But if you can't, then that fucking sucks. So I'm sorry to hear that. Uh, but welcome back. Damn it. Who the fuck is that? Alright, I'm back. God damn it, dude. It's kind of hard to alt tab out of this game. Kind of. Well, anyway, I'm back. Uh, my dinner is here. I will eat it in a little bit. Not now, though, because I kind of am in the middle of something. Yeah, pork is kind of rough for your sis for your sister. Personally, I'm a poultry cured meats kind of guy. Right on, right on. Dude, I'm so I'm so uncultured and like I have so little experience in so many things with food that I wouldn't even be able to tell you what kind of meat I enjoy. I don't like meat that is too... Do you know what gristle is, dude? I hate gristle and I hate fat. Those those types of things would drive me insane, dude. I can't stand that shit. And because I've eaten a lot of meat in my day and experienced those things that I don't enjoy, the gristle and the fat, I just tend to not really eat meat anymore or well, as much as I cannot you know I don't like totally like like oh no I, I don't want to eat that shit like you know if I want to eat it I'll eat it but you know I don't really have that much basically my favorite thing to eat ever like one thing I could just eat all the time <laughs> is pizza dude I fucking love pizza but I don't like mushrooms, and I can't stand onions. I think I hate mushrooms more than onions, but I don't like... I hate them both. I would never eat either of them, but... I can't stand mushrooms, dude. They're like my biggest nemesis in the whole world. 
Well, anyway, I wasn't really expecting to turn on the mic and begin to talk to you guys and then have my fucking food show up, but anyway. <sighs> nah, man, no mushrooms, no onions, please. I just want cheese, pepperoni, dude, maybe a little bit of barbecue. Is that shit like barbecue chicken? Because I'm white as fuck, right? I'd be one of those white trash motherfuckers that gets barbecue base. I won't get that all the time, but I'm one of those dudes, and I'll get that shit. What about olives? Nah, fuck that shit, dude. That's too rich for my blood. I'm, I don't eat vegetables, dude. I don't really eat much. Anyone that knows me will tell you that I am very picky when it comes to pretty much anything. <laughs> I'm a bit of a pussy. I don't like gross things. Uh, garlic. I fucking love garlic, but like garlic bread, dude. You know, what's, that's that's one of the fucked up things. I really enjoy garlic, but like because I've been one of these dudes that has never really learned how to cook for themselves or whatever, I only ever get what I've been given, and the people surrounding me never really go for that type of uh, flavor. But I really enjoy garlic bread and like the taste of garlic and stuff, but. Never really had that much of an opportunity to partake in it. Uh, yeah, I'm very picky, dude. It's a bit annoying. I imagine if I had a... Dude. Dude. Jesus. My fucking future wife is gonna hate me. She's gonna be like, oh, try this. And I'm gonna be like, yeah, let me try it. And then I'm just gonna fucking throw up. Nah. I'm a bit of a bitch when it comes to food, man. There's a lot I won't do. But, some things I just deal with. Like, for example, this food that I have right now, I'm pretty sure it's going to be completely packed with, like, lettuce and shit like that, but... Dude, I'm just going to... Eat the fuck out of that. You know what I mean? I don't give a shit. I'm not gonna sit there and try and pick at it. I'm like, I don't wanna eat it. It's good. But like, dude, I'll, I'm gonna destroy that shit. I'm hungry as fuck. Yo, but I will acknowledge it's definitely not my. Uh, at least whatever. Keeping up. Who gives a fuck? Well, I'm a country boy Just too. shove it down exactly, dude. From where? I'm gonna get back into the gameplay. Let me Need turn my. this mic off. <laughs> Enjoy, guys. How about you? Me? Gungaga. <laughs> hey, what's so funny about that? You know Gungaga? No, but it's such a backwater name. Ditto Nibelheim. Like you've been there. I haven't, but there's a reactor there, right? A Mako reactor outside Midgar usually means nothing, nothing else out, out there. there. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> Good news, Song! Me and... Cloud. Me and Cloud here are both backwater experts. Oh yeah! Good. Carry on then. Yo, Dio, you're really talking to my soul right now, dude. Because I cannot agree more. You, you're literally bang on the money right there, dude. Because, I'll be honest with you, dude. It's, I feel like it's been a long time since I've actually enjoyed a meal. <laughs> and I've I got to be honest, I think that has a lot to do with my attitude. Towards it, exactly. I really do echo or resonate with what you just said.
I guess I'll wait. Hey, uh, Zack? Hmm? Um, so, soldier, what's it like? Huh? I'm not getting the question. Uh... Well, you'll know once you join up. <sighs> if I can join. Don't worry. If I can do it, you can. <laughs> Cloud, look. It's Genesis. That's a Mako excavation test site. Okay, I'll check it out. Our main mission here is reconnaissance. Engaging Genesis was not expected. Not expected, so just let them be? Unreal. In any case, we need more intel. It's possible that a larger force is hiding inside the building. How's this then? I go first, avoiding combat if possible, and sneak inside. Then, I take a look around. If I can take them, I will. If not, I'll bolt. Mm. Come on, man. I'll prove that Soldier isn't just a bunch of mindless thugs. <laughs> All right. The entrance is behind that warehouse. Make your way in from there. Gotcha! I'm sure you know, but it'll be cold. Mind your body temperature. If you stop moving, your body temp will go down. To get it back up, just do your usual thing. Oh, that! Good idea! Hey guys, so the stream isn't over. I still want to continue playing this, but I just want to eat this food first. Can you guys give me like, uh, like, I don't know, like eight minutes or something? I'll be right back. I'll be back as quick as I can. I'm just gonna shove this, sh shovel this shit down my gullet, and then we'll continue. Okay. I'll change the music. I'll put a soundtrack on because. I can imagine this is a bit get a bit mind numbing while you wait, so I'll be right back. I'll put some music on.
Alright, I'm back. The Taco Bell beast has been slain. Anyway, now I have that out of the way, I can fucking focus on all this shit. That's good. Anyway, back to the game at hand.
Activating combat mode. Out of the way. Got him. What's the meaning of this? You need me, Genesis. Remember that. If you get rid of me, who's going to stop the degradation? The Genova cells. Stop! Cloud! Good work! But nobody knows where the Genova cells are being kept. Not even Hojo knows. You'll never find it. Then I shall willingly accept my fate. But I'll take the world with me. Cloud! Go! Your honor to me. I got it. Dreams of the morrow. Hath the shattered soul. Pride is lost. Wings stripped away. The end is nigh. Such is the fate of a monster. We're not monsters, you hear me? We're soldier. Where's your honor? <sighs> Even if the morrow is barren of promises, nothing shall forestall my return. If this world seeks my destruction,
It goes with me. Genesis. Song? Cloud? Where are they? Hmm? What is that hole? Did they go in? Looks like I have some voicemail messages. You have 23 messages. Message 1. Oh, wait. You guys are closed? Not another time, I guess. Message 2. Hey, party of eight for tomorrow. Oh, it's voicemail. Message. Three. My stomach's been hurting ever since I had those drinks at your place. What we'll gives? I'm gonna sue. Message four. Um, I left my bag there, I think. Can you check for me? Message five. You're still closed. You didn't go out of business, I hope. Message. Are there any front row seats left? Message 7. It's closed. Message 8. D-Day is coming up. Make sure you're open then. Understand? Message 9. Please answer our questionnaire and we'll... Message 10. Can we rent your place for a private party? Message 11. You've still got the package over there in the store, right? Worst case, the deal's still on, even if you ain't open for business. Message 12. 
This is the recycling service. We're calling to ask what time you want us to come by for pickup. Message 13. Sorry about this, but we have to move D-Day. I'll call you in the new data set. Message 14. If you're closing for good, what's gonna happen to my personal bottle? Message 15. Did you close up the spa too? Message 16. I went over and it was closed. What's going on? Message 17. There's been some trouble. The deal's off. You're not gonna be able to reach me for a while. Message 18. Hi, I have a reservation for tomorrow. I'm really looking forward to it. Message 19. I heard your clothes for renovations. When's the reopening? Message 20. This is the Shinra Tourist Bureau. We're calling today to inquire about reusing your facilities. Message 21. Looks like I won't be able to pick up the package. I'm sorry, but you're gonna have to get rid of it for me. All right. Message 22. Oh, uh, I'm sorry. Wrong number. Message 23. I'm sure you already know, but the location of the package is inside the trunk next to the stage. There's something in the trunk. Activating combat mode. Activating combat mode. Geo monsters. Does that mean he's here? Activating combat mode. Oh yeah! 
Activating combat mode. Conflict resolved. Oh yeah! Activating combat mode. Out of the way! Looks like I have some voicemail. Activating combat mode. Conflict resolved. Oh yeah! Cloud, come on. I'm okay. Song! Song! Up ahead. You have to catch Hollander. And Geo is waiting for you.
Activating combat mode. There is a slot. <clears throat> the steam has stopped. Activating combat mode. It should have been me. I should have dealt with Genesis. Yeah. Then why'd you send me? To prepare you for your next fight. Have you lost it? <laughs> Stop it! Someone's waiting for you, no? Angeal, don't do this. Very good, Angeal. It is time to exact vengeance for our family's suffering. Family? No! My father is dead! <laughs> Fine. Then do it for your mother. My mother's shame made her take her own life! Shame? How terribly misguided. She should have been proud. Proud that she was the namesake of our experiment. Project G, or should I say, Project Jillian? Ugh. Don't say her name. <sighs> Jillian, the woman implanted with Genova cells. Genesis, who had her genes mapped onto him during the fetal stage. Yes, Genesis was a failure. I'll admit it. But you, Angeal, you were actually bred inside Jillian's body. You... You are perfection. Ugh. Zach, I am perfect. A perfect... monster. My cells can absorb genetic traits and pass them along to others. A two-way conduit. 
Genova's power has passed on to you completely. Zack, do you remember what I said about our enemy being all that creates suffering? Yeah, but you're not one of them. But I created my own suffering. Zack, let me show you. Stop it! You don't know what you're doing! So you have no problem bombing this village? Cause I have a big problem with it. All evidence of misconduct must be erased. As a Turk, I must enforce company policy. Bad excuse again.
Zack. You have my thanks. <laughs> this is for you. Protect your honor, always. <laughs> Embrace your dreams. If you want to be a hero, you need to have dreams and honor. The sky is closer, in the city above, right? Kinda scary, but the flowers might like it, maybe. So you want to be in Soldier? Hang in there. So, is everybody here now? Sir! You're all rookies, right? Sir! Yes, sir! One piece of advice. No. An order. Embrace your dreams. And, whatever happens, protect your soldier honor. Got it? Sir! We're all coming back here alive. You hear me? Let's go. Project G was Angel's mother's experiment. I apprehended Hollander and Modeoheim and turned him over to the company. After that, the company put me on standby. That was a while ago. Shinra is in disarray. 
The Turks are hanging around me every day. They say our vacations overlapped coincidentally. Yeah, right. But none of them ever mention Angeal. Or Genesis. Not a whisper. Almost. As if they never existed. Is that how little soldier is worth? What exactly... Do I have left to fight for? What is... Soldier Honor? Suntan lotion? No. <laughs> Never mind that. <laughs> what is this? Are they <laughs> putting me out to pasture? You could use some R&R. &R. I'm bored. That's it? I'm calling them. Director Lazard's not in. He's been missing for a while now. It was Lazard who was funding Hollander's research. Using the company's money. Are you serious? We're interrogating Hollander, so we should learn more soon. What's wrong with them? Hmm? People, what are they all thinking? The truth lies within each person. But even truth seems suspect once it leaves their mouths. <laughs> Cisne, go do something. Calling Aerith? How do you know that? Am I being watched? No, she's the one being watched. Hmm? Huh? That girl is an ancient. The only one left in the world. You didn't know? She... never said anything. Mm. The only one... left in the world, huh? She is one of a kind. Heads up! Genesis copies! Genesis copies? Here? Activating combat mode. These guys are still around? But Genesis... Genesis may be around too. Huh? When the soul leaves the body, it returns to the life stream. Yeah, and? A river of souls circles the planet. Perhaps Genesis' soul is also... Controlling copies from the life stream? Is that what you're saying? Just a supposition. In any case, your vacation's over. Come with me. Junon is under attack by an unknown force. Again! They're just running wild! Activating combat mode.
Taking you down a peg. That's enough! How about this? Gonna love this! Hollander is in Juna now. His presence can't be a coincidence. It's not over yet, is it? We'll evacuate the residents. You work on securing Hollander. I'm securing Hollander? Don't you need me on the battlefield? Hollander has top secret information. The president says he's priority one. With Director Lazard absent, Soldier's chain of command is shaky at best. These attackers exploited that weakness. Zach, you're the only one who can move freely. You must secure Hollander. Hollander is being held at the 8th level detention center in Upper Juno. Use the emergency elevator to go up. It's at the end of this path. Zach, we need this. He's still being interrogated. He can't fall into enemy hands. Okay, I'll go.
Combat mode.
Activating combat mode. Bring it on. Ah. Ah. Oh, yeah. Resolved. Activating combat mode. Combat mode. Oh, yeah. 
conflict resolved. Oh, yeah. It's about time you use that sword of yours. Brace yourself. Prove your honor to me. I got it. Love this! Ah! 
This is not good. Ah! All's well that ends well, Slick. It's done. That's Turk's teamwork. Pretty good, right?
Activating combat mode. Conflict resolved. Oh yeah! Genesis. No, a copy. Activating combat mode. <laughs> Escaped. What? They already hit us upstairs? No, but security was spread thin after the attack, and he used that opportunity to escape. He escaped? On his own? Yes. It's as if he knew an attack was about to occur. It's possible that he received some outside help. Where is he? Are there any leads? Cameras in the sixth level of Upper Junon have a positive ID on Hollander. We're on the sixth level of Lower Junon, so he should be somewhere up ahead. To go to Upper Junon, go through the Central Passageway Gate and go straight. Press the switch to operate the gate. All right. You look after the wounded. Sir! As for Hollander, leave him to me. No. 
copies. Activating combat mode. Model? Yeah. Just you wait, Hollander. Activating combat mode. this a place of refuge making progress huh as for me i still haven't secured hollander gotta move yes understood That way is the airbase. He's trying to get away by air? No way. <sighs> come, come, come. <laughs> I wonder what happens to Junok if you can't stop them. Hmm? Ah, damn it. He's destroying the gate to attack the civilians. Hollander, once I catch you, I'll deck you good! Activating combat mode. 
now we've got scorpion types? Hollander's too well connected. Activating combat mode. Ah! Oh, Cisne. How about dinner tonight? Sorry, I've got work. They just told me. Hmm, too bad. You want me to talk to your boss? I don't recommend that. My boss can be pretty scary. Brace yourself! You can do it, Zach. things here did you say something let's move on better run for it concentrate I'm feeling it Hollanders that way, right? I really have to get serious now. <laughs> That's far enough! <sighs> really? You sure? Hey! What is he... Should have known. <clears throat> Mission failed. This goes on your permanent record. Uh, huh? Sephiroth? Long time no see. Let the Turks take care of the rest. I was on my way to Modeoheim, but I heard you were in the area. Lucky me. The situation has not resolved. Genesis copies have been sighted around the world. That can't be. We wiped out those Genesis copies. Did Genesis really die? Uh. They've been sighted in Midgar as well. I see. The slums too. Permission to return, granted. Uh, uh, yeah. Take care. You too. Hey, what's going on in Modeoheim? The device Hollander was using has been stolen. Genesis? Probably. Uh We'll meet again soon. I'll hold you to that. My friend, your desire is the bringer of life, the gift of the goddess. Legend shall speak of sacrifice at world's end. The wind sails over the water's surface, quietly, but surely.
I thought I sensed something, but... Maybe not? Geocopy? Thank you. Was it protecting us? Yeah, probably. <gasps> Looks like it's degrading. Poor thing. Does this mean Angel is out there too? What did you come here to do? So, a flower wagon. Let's make one. Hmm. Yeah, but... Don't worry. Can you hear me? Stay right where you are. I'll... I'll take care of things. So, that flower wagon, let's do it. Come on, Zach. Come this way. Uh, yeah. Hey, Aerith. When the wagon's done, will you go above the plate? Yeah, but I'm still a little scared. So first... I'll fill the slums with flowers. Oh, come on. When you go above, I'll be with you. Don't be afraid. Zach, thank you. Right. Now that that's done, let's get this wagon built. I'll go gather the materials. Aerith, you wait here. Yep. Everyone, ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> it's been eight hours and 21 minutes. I think I'm gonna fuck off. I will come back at some point and we'll play some more, probably tomorrow, maybe. We'll see. Depends how I feel. But, see these missions, all these silly side quests I probably will play more of these while I'm off stream maybe we'll see but I'm gonna head out 
Hey Dio, thanks for hanging out, man. As always, I appreciate it. I wish you the best, man. And I look forward to whenever you decide to stream again. Everyone, take care of yourselves, okay? I really mean that. Um, see you later.